my heart in California I let it go deep into the blue I could be happy in California I would be fine with just me and you And a very romantic and warm welcome to Peachy. As we all know, Valentine's Day is around the corner, and today I want to share with you my top five hacks that will help you slay your Valentine's Day whether you have a partner or not. We are going to talk about things like makeup, hair, outfits, dating, and more. So if you need some inspiration this Valentine's Day, you should stay tuned right now. Hack number one. Let's be honest, V-Day makeup is a science, it needs to be glamorous, it needs to be seductive, but it should also be kiss-proof and not prone to smudging, all whilst not looking too cakey either. Here's a makeup look for you guys that fulfills all that criteria. Winged eyeliner paired with a soft pink shade of matte liquid lipstick. Both the liquid eyeliner and the matte liquid lipstick have completely drying formulas, so they won't smudge all night. At the same time, it's a super glamorous look that looks flattering on pretty much every woman. If you want to go a bit bolder, you could also rock a lipstick in one of the typical Valentine's Day shades like hot pink, red, purple, whatever you like. As long as you use matte liquid lipstick, you should be fine. Hack number two. In terms of hairstyles, I think most girls try to do something wavy or curly. There's only one problem. The typical waves created with a curling iron or even hot rollers wear down really quickly and let's be honest, you can't have that on Valentine's Day when everything can happen. Here's my special trick to give your hair some wavy texture that lasts all night, even if you have really heavy hair like myself. You take a straightening iron, separate a small strand of your hair and then create each individual wave by twisting the straightening iron into the opposite direction. It does take a bit of practice and it's not super healthy for the hair because all the parts of the hair strands are directly exposed to the heat but it's for that same reason that this hairstyle is more long lasting than others. Either way, you repeat that process until there are no straight strands left. To finish off, just spray some hairspray in the palm of your hands and massage it into your waves. And voila, you have a natural looking beautiful sexy waves texture that will last all night. Hack number 3. With the outfit for V-Day, it's pretty much as much of a science as with a makeup look. You want to wear something that flatters your body shape, that you feel comfortable in, but that's also somewhat festive without looking like you put a lot of effort into it. Basically, you want to look casually gorgeous. One trick that really helps catering to those criteria is combining something sweet and feminine with something edgy. Pick a dress or something similar to a dress that you feel really promotes your best features and that's somewhat feminine and chic. Combine that with an edgy statement piece like a leather jacket or maybe a jeans jacket to make the look more effortless. If you are more the trousers kind of girl, I recommend high-waisted jeans, high heels and an exciting blouse or top in a soft, thin material like satin or silk. High-waisted jeans accentuate the hip-waist ratio and therefore are often figure flattering, especially when you combine them with heels. The silk blouse, on the other hand, is very gentle, very feminine and it adds back the casualness to the look. Hack number four. And of course, Valentine's Day wouldn't be the same without the little gift. You need a gift that shows that you've put some thought into it, but it also shouldn't come across as if you've already got the wedding all planned out. And let's be honest, it should be cheap. Here's what you can do. Step 1. Find out your date's favorite chocolate and favorite liquor. Step 2. Buy a heart-shaped box. During the time around Valentine's Day you can get them everywhere in a lot of places. Step 3. Buy some of his favorite chocolate bars as well as miniature versions of his favorite liquors and place all of that in the heart-shaped box. By the way, these miniature versions of liquors you can usually get in every corner store. And there you have it, the perfect Valentine's Day's gift for your man, generic enough to not be perceived as creepy, but also individual enough to still count as a thoughtful gift. Hack number 5. Today's last hack is one for the most substantial problems when it comes to Valentine's Day. You don't have a date. 
That kind of sucks, I get it. The good news is there is a new app on the market called Woo Plus that might just get you exactly what you want in time for V-Day. Woo Plus is a dating community designed especially for extra curvy or plus size singles or just people who have a general preference for curvy or partners because there's less room for things like fat shaming and you can be sure that the people you match with really love your body type. It has over 1 million users with thousands of single people joining each day. They're a female friendly app that advocates body positivity and where users are often looking for a serious relationship. So if you're still in search for a date on V-Day, make sure you download the app from the link in the description box below. All right, my lovelies, that was it for me today. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you found it useful as always. And yeah, if you did like it, I would of course be very happy about a thumbs up or a little comment. And otherwise guys, I'm just gonna wish you the most wonderful Valentine's Day and I'm gonna see you very soon in a few days or next week, we'll see. Maybe I'm gonna do two videos next week. We shall see, adios.